I'm Jordan. I graduated at the end of October 2023 and I work at Cleric Computer Services. Before joining North Coders, I worked as a paramedic. During my time as a custody suite paramedic, I was using some software that felt particularly dated. I found it very frustrating to use and there was a bit of maybe I can do it better and the here I was at the boot camp before I knew it. Cleric Computer Services make software mainly used by the ambulance service. So things from patient transport to call services and to the paperwork that paramedics like myself use on the road. It was quite a, a nice change to see how it works from the other side. And I think they really appreciate that I'm able to apply my, I guess, field experience to their application when designing new pages or changing how certain things work. My mentors were fantastic. Pretty much was in touch with them most days because there was a lot of things I was sort of struggling to get my head around. A lot of them were able to go into real nitty gritty details and explain it on a very basic level. And then I was sort of able to extrapolate from there and apply what I'd learned going forward. I think the highlight is project phase. And I think a lot of people will say that because a lot of the time spent on the boot camp is learning the basics, learning how to do a bit of everything. But the, the project phase is sort of you're let loose and you go build whatever you want. Just use all the tools that you've been taught on the way. And that's really fantastic. So I think that's why a lot of people love project phase. Career support was um, really good. I found that in healthcare, you, you write a very descriptive CV, sort of covering your skills and what experiences and exposures you've had. Whereas in tech, it was very to the point. So rewriting it to have like a lot of bullet points and just sort of describe what languages and frameworks and testing had used. So the careers service was really good for that. Moving from healthcare to tech was a bit jarring more for my, my everyday schedule. That was particularly strange moving to a nine to five from shifts but kind of the problem solving aspects that exist in healthcare were translated quite well. I think the boot camp gave me the necessary skills to not be as worried when approaching some of the problems that I'll face when working with code. I've found that I'm able, it, it's, it's quite strange to transition to a full project when most of what you're doing on the boot camp is making things from scratch, but it's been quite good to be able to go in and just understand the code that I'm reading that's already written. And if there's sort of areas that I don't understand, I can just go to my senior and they'll be able to explain it in terms that I was more exposed to on the bootcamp. North Coders cohorts feel quite big, but you do a lot of pair programming throughout it. And you definitely sort of make a few connections. Uh, there's a few people I'm still in touch with. There was a group of us that went out for some bowling and some drinks only a few weeks ago. As far as I'm aware, most of them now have work in the tech industry and we do try our best to keep in touch. I think there's a lot of people that will want to sort of wait until they think they're at an experience that they need to be. And I'd say two weeks before you think you're ready, you're probably already ready. So you might as well apply.